Good morning. Good morning, you guys. What is up? Welcome back to another video on my channel. I've been trying to post more because I have more time and it's fun and literally posting videos. It's like Christmas morning. Anyways. I purposely didn't put an alarm on this morning because I wanted to sleep in and I just still woke up at 8.30. It's now 9.15. I laid in bed for 20 minutes and went on Twitter and TikTok and Instagram and all the things. Anyways, I thought today I would do a quarantine morning routine for you guys because um, I got a lot of requests and I've kind of gotten into a little bit more of a, not even a routine, just kind of like what I do when I wake up in the morning. Um, and I just remembered that one from this video, so I can't lie. I already did my skincare, so I'll show you guys really quick what I did to my face when I woke up. But I woke up, I made my bed instantly, turned on my twinkle lights instantly. Good vibes. Popped on a hoodie, actually, because it's a little chilly outside. It's kind of nice. I'm wearing my Twin Flames hoodie that Keaton gifted me. She's a fellow YouTuber, and she designed this, and I'm obsessed with it. I always edit videos at night for whatever reason. I don't really know why, so I'm just exporting that video that I edited last night so I can upload it. I read a little bit of this last night. It's really good. But yeah, I'll show you guys the skincare I used really quick. So every morning I come in here and I use these. These are the Naturally Serious Cold Pressed Peel Pads. They're so refreshing. And then I sprayed on this matcha spray from Urban Outfitters. And then I used my Olay Henriksen eye cream. And that was kind of the vibe for this morning. It woke me up, refreshed me. And there's a, Freddy, I literally just made my bed. This is definitely a part of my quarantine morning routine, by the way. He comes in and I'm just- I'm so bored. You're so bored? Uh -huh. Gonna eat my bagel in here. Um, I usually start the day with like YouTube work because I like it a lot better and then I go into school work So I can now upload this video It's time to do some school work popping on the blue light glasses I have an assignment for my textiles class and then I also have to take an online quiz for my psych class by Sunday and today's Thursday, but I'm kind of in the mood to get it done guys it is time for coffee usually I make coffee right when I wake up these days but I've noticed sometimes I'm like so tired that the coffee doesn't work so that's why I tried to eat first and do some work and then when I really need the boost get some coffee so I'm gonna do that now and go sit out back and get some fresh air <sighs> this is the routine guys it's not like get up and hustle it's like get up and slowly start your day because you can <laughs> I also want to work out. Don't worry, that will happen. Oh god, do I want to make an espresso or an actual pot of coffee? This is, this is the question. I just got these Nespresso pods. I was inspired by Maggie McDonald. She said that Starbucks Pike has Nespresso pods. I was so excited, so I got these from Amazon. I'll link them below. done frothing. I wish I knew how to do latte art so badly. See, I wish I knew how to do the cool art stuff. Hot latte it is, baby. on I'm in the music to like really jam to music also I just realized my lights aren't on I have this habit of using like natural daylight which is awesome but it's kind of dark headphones on world out I'm so excited. Prevello, the spin studio I teach at, 
just came out with their online store so you could buy their merch online since their studios aren't open right now. Um, so I got three things that I'm so excited. I got the new Pure Velo hat, but it just says Pure and it's super sleek, super cool. Pure Velo socks. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. They're such good quality too. They're great for spin shoes or just your sneakers, whatever. And they'll just remind you of Pure Velo. It makes me so happy. And then a pint glass. Like, this is so hype. Literally, Pure Velo or die for real. I'll have a link down below to the online shop if you guys want to check it out. But I'm obsessed. And they have all their really cute, like, workout sets online as well. But I already have, like, most of them. There's, like, one more that I really want like the leopard one but yeah obsessed all right it's time for a workout I'm gonna start off with a really long bike ride I'm gonna pop my airpods in play some intense music pretend I'm on a spin bike <laughs> and ride around and then I might do like a core workout after I haven't really decided yet it'll honestly just be the mood but I need some workout clothes to put on here Let's see what do I want to wear is it like so obnoxious to wear my bright pink <laughs> Maybe I should just go for like a black. I'm going with this camo halter top from Lululemon and Lululemon leggings. The other day I wore like a really bright yellow happy set and I loved it and it put me in a really good mood. However, today I'm riding alone and I just don't really want to be like a, like a I don't really want to stick out, you know? Like I kind of just like want to do my own thing. So we're going to go for a darker situation today. We collide, we break down. Caving in to our doubts Faces filled with sadness When words are said, we'll regret I can see the fire that we made just to save us When we try to make up for never letting go Promise not to say that we break up just to start all over even though we know all right guys i am back from my bike ride i biked about eight miles it was so so nice like it just felt like myself and the rest of the I just felt like it was just me on this planet. It was really, really, really nice. And I'm so thankful that I can still go on bike rides because I think I would actually go nuts. So yeah, it was just like a really good start to me. I got a lot of like nerves and anxiety out sometimes when I'm feeling really anxious or like after I drink coffee, you know, I'm like, ugh. So I needed to move and I'm so glad I went and did that and I feel so, so much better. So now I'm gonna take a shower get changed into some other comfy outfit and um i on today's thursday and on tuesdays and thursdays i don't have any live zoom classes only one of my classes out of five of them have a live zoom thing so when i'm out of my shower and i'm changed i'm going to watch my accounting lecture that he just posted and take notes on that crazy stuff here's my little school ootd if you will i just found this top in my closet here i'm not really sure where it's from i think it's from like fashion nova or something i don't even know it's kind of fun and then i'm just wearing these sweatpants from brandy melville that i got actually forever ago it's just kind of comfy but yeah we're gonna do some more skincare i have no point in wearing makeup and i kind of like how my skin looks better without makeup right now if that makes sense i don't know i think it's because my face is tanner and when i put on makeup i feel like it like cakes up and it's just not as natural looking so let's go do that all right so first off i'm going to use my sephora glow peel pads these are a little bit more exfoliating um and they're just super refreshing and i just love them as you guys can tell i like peel pads <laughs> So one side is like more rigid and the other side is more smooth. So I'm just getting all the gunk off my face from just like going for the bike ride and sweating and even though I showered also I obviously didn't wash my hair. I've been using my Dyson Air Wrap and I used it yesterday and like my hair still looks great and it's not oily or anything so no point in washing it. Next up I'm going to use my Ole Henriksen Truth Serum. This has been the daytime serum I've been using. I just love how it feels on my skin and it gives your skin a nice glow and it just smells good. Perfect. My roller here, draining my lymphatics. And then lastly, I'm gonna use more of this eye cream I was showing you guys earlier, the Ole Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. And 
yeah, I'm no expert, but this is what I've been doing. I like to put makeup on every couple days just for fun, you know, it's something to do. And then I'll just spray the same matcha. It's the brand Ohi, by the way, Pumped Up Hydration Skin Quench Serum. Let's call this the setting spray. And yeah, that is everything I've been doing. Actually, one last thing. Um, I'm not really gonna touch my hair much. I brushed it a little bit. I don't wanna like completely ruin it, but um, it does look a little bit dry on my ends. Um, so I'm gonna use this Olaplex number seven bonding oil. This is what I'll kind of use on second day just to kind of refresh my ends um, with dry shampoo also, but I don't really need dry shampoo right now. So I'm just popping this on my ends to make them shiny and pretty. And Olaplex is amazing for your hair, so. Trying to take the best of care of my hair as possible while I have all this time. All right, I'm gonna get back to it. I hope you guys enjoyed this quarantine morning routine, if you will, if you guys liked it um, and you wanna see more videos like this, please let me know, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new here, I'm posting videos all the time, seriously, so you can be notif notified. Follow me on all of my other social media because I'm posting a lot more and I'm trying to inspire you guys in any way I can. I love you guys. Stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy, and just remember you're not stuck at home, you're safe at home. Love you guys.